hi, welcome back, Rikers Reptiles. If this is your first time watching, subscribe, click the like button. And uh, tonight we're gonna go into how do you heat up your rats? Do you do it in a cup, take a long time? Do you do it room temperature? Do you have a, a cooker? Or do you use a sous vide? That's what we're gonna do. So stick around, we'll be right back. So what is a sous vide? This is a sous vide. I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but I think sous vide is what I've heard people say. I put the water in here from the bathtub. It was pretty hot, 126 degrees. I set the temperature to 100 on here because I just want to defrost them and not cook them. So this will keep it at 100 degrees. I can put it for 100 hours or, or just an hour. So I put it to the pot. I'm gonna go down and get my rats, put them in the bags so they keep them dry. And then we'll go ahead and put it on the uh, side of the pot and see how it does. Stay tuned. Okay, I got the first three in there, a medium, a couple smalls. Now I have the next batch. This one has like a little baby one, some small weaned. We got two, three mediums. And then I put some washers down in here to help weight it down and keep it down and away from the uh, cooker. Okay, so I'm going to put the other one in there and then we'll see. Looks good. Looks like you could cook about eight, nine rats at a time in this size pot. Because I got uh, four, five, six, seven and some little guys. So at least eight to ten small rats, maybe six medium rats. And we'll go for about 30 minutes and then I'll come back and test them. It's dropped from 120 something down to 119. I have it set at 100 degrees. Okay, we'll come back and check on them, about 30 minutes. Okay, after about 20 minutes, these little guys are ready to go. go right away with this big one. I'll probably want to heat up those other little guys a little more just to have them warm right when I go to feed the corn snake. Okay, and he's first. Oh, jeez. Decided to take a bath. I had to rescue him. All right, I just pulled them out of the sous vide. I'm gonna test to see the temperature of them. All right, so I got 91, that's probably warm enough. Let's see if it worked. I'll go with Elio first. Hope that worked out. That's the spider for you. A little whoop. wonky. Good job, Brittany. She went five months without eating. And now she's taking meals every week. Hey Jim, you ready to eat? So 
sometimes Jim has to be asked three times. It's one of my slowest eaters for males. Okay, let's see what Daryl's got. He's hungry. He's been in with Angela all week. That was a good one. It scared me a little. Oof. Right, right on the head. Let's see what we got left here. Michael Scott got his. Daryl got his. Jim still needs to eat. Elio ate. Creed hasn't eaten in two months. Let's see what Creed will do. Okay, Creed was in shed. There it is. Perfect little shed. Let's see if we'll go for it. I'm going to turn down the lights a little for this guy. Well, this is one of the pickiest eaters right now. Might not happen. He's not showing interest. He's backing up. Hiding back there. There he is. All right, we'll go back to Jim. Oh, hey, Jim. Uh, Jim's right there, ready to rock.
Well, only took two times. It's an improvement. So just to be sure, we got Elio. Put that pig back. We got Jim. We got Daryl. Check to see if Michael ate his live rat. Finishing off his business. We'll leave him alone. Placeholder. Pam's got a live rat in there. She doesn't like it. She's upset with me. Andy already ate. And he looks hungry. Still. And last but not least, Aaron is up here just chilling back there. Maybe she wants to eat. We'll see what she's going to do. She didn't eat last week. Okay, it seems like if I have it at 105, then it will heat the rat to about 90. So if you do maybe 110, it'll be maybe 93, 94. And a, I think a, a live rat is around 92 to 94 degrees. Erin did not mess around today. Boy, she was hungry. Good one. Okay, we'll see how these girls do. The mediums. I might have to defrost a couple mediums here because it seems like everybody's eating tonight. We'll start with Kelly and then go to Pam and we'll see uh, who eats. Well, Kelly went for hers a lot quicker than normal. Overall, the sous vide was a great investment right there, sous vide. Uh, cut probably an hour off of my feed tonight because uh, I could heat up more at once. Didn't have to make 10 trips to the bathroom to get hot water in these uh, cups. This is how I was doing it before. Two rats at a time in each cup. Notice this is a rat on the side of the cup. All right, signing off. Until next video. Bye.